Dr. Graham did not mention Watergate at all in his address to over 1,000 Presbyterians at the Sheraton Hotel today. Instead, he told of his recent crusade in Korea. He praised what he called the great work of the Korean Presbyterian Church and their great spiritual power. Following his address to the assembly, Dr. Graham visited with the young people at the gathering and then held a news conference. The first question asked of him concerned Watergate and his support of President Nixon, which he avoided answering except to say he is a Democrat. I asked him about a passage in the New Testament scripture which I'm reportedly sure deals can... with the current Watergate scandal. I used that as the text of my uh, article in the New York Times about six weeks ago on the subject of Watergate. And uh, it was Nehemiah 8, 1 to 3, and I got it from the New York Times because Harrison Salisbury had come up with it from somebody and put it in the New York Times, and it was the uh, first time I'd ever seen it there that uh, Ezra and Nehemiah gathered the people together to read the law at the Watergate. And I would say it's a very appropriate thing right now that uh, uh, because of Watergate, and all the things that are happening in the country and in the world, it's time to read the law of the Lord and get on our knees and repent of our sins and turn to God. We're living in a very dangerous hour. Dr. Graham says he believes President Nixon will survive the current conflict and remain the president for three and a half more years. Asked about the tight security at the hotel today, Dr. Graham said he was glad to see the policemen because they need religion too. Jim Green, Channel 8 News on the Move in Fort Worth.